Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today we are talking about the Elementor affiliate program plus a few different ways to make money. I'm going to explain exactly what Elementor is, a few different ways to make money, as well as the commission structure and the cookie window. So if you are interested in learning about different affiliate programs, be sure to like, subscribe, and ring the bell to be notified when I upload a brand new video. First things first, what is Elementor? Elementor is a theme or web page builder. Uh, this is something that you would install on top of WordPress. Uh, WordPress is a website builder just to go through the process without getting too technical if you want to have a website on the internet you need web hosting and then one of the most popular types of content management software is wordpress and then you would install wordpress on top of your web hosting software and then you can use something like elementor to build a custom wordpress theme one of the challenges with wordpress and wordpress themes is they're all very templated they all kind of look the same if you want the benefits of wordpress without the templates in the and making your website look just like everyone else's you would get something like elementor so uh, now that we've gone through that technical walkthrough you can see there's all sorts of, of things that you can do with it um, you can do everything for from making it your website a resume collecting email addresses there's just so much that you can do and there's a lot of opportunity if you do the right thing so if we look at this here it's just for web designers so if you are working with um, let's say you are a um, WordPress developer, you could actually install Elementor onto WordPress and you could charge people, make money that way. Um, if you are a small business, if you're a marketer, different agencies, there's a lot of opportunities. You can see small business here. Um, you just have to decide which direction that you want to go. And I'm going to help you with that right now. So looked up some things on YouTube, for example, how to start a WordPress blog. We could do WordPress blog just like this. And then you could even type in something for, and there's a lot of opportunities for beginners, for affiliate marketing and you just simply would want to create videos about all of this now in my opinion you wouldn't want to just promote elementor you'd want to promote web hosting you'd want to promote maybe even email marketing and as well as a a wordpress world builder like elementor so um, i think you could make a pretty good amount of money if you promote an entire ecosystem or a bunch of uh, a bunch of affiliate programs that work together but if you look at this there are thousands and millions of views to be had in this in this space. If we did how to create a WordPress website for free, um, that's not a great one because they're looking for free stuff, but how to create a WordPress website for a client. You click on that and you just show them how to do it. And then you put Elementor, the affiliate link in the description. But if you look at this third one here, uh, 5,000 views, 2,000 subscribers, a tiny channel getting ranked th third. Uh, this one, 14,000 views. But you can see there are lots of people having success. Look at this one right here. How to build a secure WordPress client portal. Uh, 1.6 thousand subscribers, 17,000 views. One thing that you can do, and I'm going to show you a, a YouTube channel that's doing it. His name is Darren uh, Wilson. He has hundreds of thousands of subscribers. In fact, he has multiple channels. Um, he, he puts his videos in different languages. But if you take a look at this, this is really cool. Um, how to create an e-commerce website. You could include your affiliate link to Elementor. If we did, let's just type in how to create, how to create an e-commerce website with WordPress, just like that. If we take a look, top result, as I said, Darren Wilson, Darren Wilson, um, there are large channels doing this, but you can do it too. And the cool thing with this is you're going to rack up watch time and you're going to rack up subscribers because you have long view duration. And so it's going to get pushed out. The only issue that you're going to run into is uploading consistently. But, you know, how to create a, a e-commerce website. Um, you can also do the same thing with like how to build a um, how to build a form website. Just go through like I did here and do like how to build a underscore website. And then you can go through and you can do something like F and it's going to show you, as you can see, how to build a form website. If we click on this, you're going to see people are doing this exact thing and they're getting thousands of views because they're going to, the, the people that are watching this are going to turn around and then sell this as a skill that they know how to do. And so you're going to get lots of views and watch time, but this is just one, one way. Another way you can do it is as you can see how to create an underscore website. Uh, just go through each letter of the alphabet and create these videos uh, how to build a movie website now the reason why i'm not showing you a blog a blog is really competitive so if we say uh, if we jump over to ahrefs this is a keyword research tool that i use we could say how to build let's do how to and then hit search and then i'm going to go to website 
include the word website no well, you're going to see these are really competitive look at this and so your area of opportunity is going to be with starting a youtube channel you can also do something with pinterest as you can see and one thing that you could do is let's look at this one how to start a lifestyle blog from scratch we're going to click on this we're going to actually go to the the page here and you can see they've started a blog if you want to start a blog you can but i recommend that you do something else in addition like pinterest or a youtube channel or even a facebook group but what we can do is we can take this so we're going to open let's copy the link address we're going to go over to ahrefs and we're going to take a look and see what other words she's ranking for and this is going to give us an idea of so we'll paste that in this is going to give us an idea of the things that she's ranking for and possibly things that we could write about so while that's working as you can see this is a large website it has over 52,000 keywords uh, but you can see this is exactly what she's doing. She's teaching you how to start a blog and she's making money in a few different ways. She's collecting email addresses. She's recommending probably Bluehost or one or the other. Okay, so she's recommending. Um, this is SiteGround, but she's probably also telling you to get a premium WordPress theme. So if we go back over, let's see. Uh, another thing that you can do is you can do Elementor Verses and talk about the pros and cons and the strengths and weaknesses of Elementor versus Divi or some of the other ones. You could also do Divi, um, Divi alternatives. Now, the good thing about doing alternatives is that these people, let's see, let's get rid of it. The, the good thing with Divi alternatives is that these people already know and understand WordPress. They already know and understand WordPress themes. You're just getting them to switch from Divi to Elementor. So if you created a video about five R alternatives, see six future proof Divi builder alternatives, uh, 68 views from 10 months ago. But if you create alternatives, that's an opportunity to rank as well. Um, let's see, we can, where are we here? Let's go back to, um, all right, so let's take a look at this one. If we look, there are some low competition keywords in this space, but you want to make sure that they are relevant to WordPress and even to Elementor or else you'd be wasting your time. Uh, but this is a cool way to see what else she ranks for and potentially start making money. So uh, we've got YouTube. There's a bunch of different ways to YouTube. You could start a blog. I don't want to discourage you from starting a blog. That's an opportunity, uh, but you would have to, you'd have to find a way to niche down. One thing that I tried to do, and I just tried to type in blog here hit enter and I tried to and I can't guarantee you this is gonna work um, let's change the keyword difficulty to I think it was zero what I tried to do is I tried to piggyback off of other blogs that were established for example um, when you type in blog oftentimes let's change this to um, so most of these blogs are actually blog titles like so these are domain names or um, familiar blogs what I attempted to do and I didn't get much success is I tried to uh, use this domain name for example and then talk about how they created it for example I talked about the um, the theme of the the blog or the website I talked about web hosting and I talked about using the type of theme I tried it a couple times and it didn't work so I stopped doing it so that might be something that you'd want to look into. Maybe you do it with a YouTube channel. So if we copy this, and this is this could be a good way to start making money with um, with web hosting and those things without having to directly write. So I'm just going to paste this into YouTube, and I can't guarantee you this is going to do anything, but um, this could be a cool way to potentially potentially start getting traffic. And so the theory is, is you would explain exactly uh, the background of Nick Fleming blog. And the reason why I'm bringing this up is because people do basically the same thing about YouTube channels. And so the theory is, and you'd have to test this, is you would, you would say, hey, this video is all about the Nick Fleming blog, you know, the type of content that they create, uh, how they set up their blog too. And you'd show them how to set up a blog. And one of the ways that you would make money is you'd put the affiliate link to Elementor. You'd say, hey, look, uh, here is... Uh, one thing that you want to get is a premium WordPress theme. Here's um, a theme builder that's going to help you build uh, your website, or here's a website builder that's going to help you build your website much faster. I think that could work. I don't see anybody really doing it. Um, if we go back over here, you would have to consistently upload, and you would just basically talk about the blog or the website. All right, so without further ado, let's go ahead and talk to, and you know, before I do that, the reason why I bring this up is because people will talk about popular YouTube 
channels. For example, we'll say like how does or how much how much does um, underscore you make on YouTube. And this has really nothing to do with the actual uh, purpose of this video, but um, you can say how much does blank make on YouTube and then you can add in, um, we could add in a, um, let's see if we can find one real quick, of course. For example, how much does Jessica make on YouTube? People are asking this question and there are tons of views. So in theory, I believe what you could do, and there's no guarantee that this would work, is do the same thing with these blogs. You could actually talk about these major blogs, um, how much money they make potentially, um, how they how you can do it too, and what they would need is obviously they would need WordPress, they would need web hosting, they would probably need a theme builder, and you could potentially make money that way. All right, so let's go ahead and finally talk about the affiliate program, how much money you can make. With this program, you can make 50% commission on every sale. Now, this does not say that it's reoccurring. The reason why I bring that up is because this program cost is reoccurring. Um, you pay $49 per year or $89 per year. I assume that it's only a one-time a one-time charge. So you would get paid um, $50, and these are the different levels here. You'd get paid $50 um, once. And and there you go. So uh, just to recap real quick, I know I kind of got in the weeds a little bit. I think one of the best ways is to uh, teach people how to build a type of website. For example, we've got war form here. Another thing that we could do is a movie website. You could also create a Udemy course and give it away for free. Do a one hour Udemy course. And you can either talk about Elementor itself most likely if people are looking up Elementor here, they already have it and they know what it is. You could say how to start a blog just like this or a website or a type of website and potentially make money. As you can see, there are lots of people doing it. And if you decided to charge for it, you'd make money on both the front end and back end. What you could do is you could give away free training on free training on YouTube and then point people to your paid Udemy course, and then include your Elementor in both places and potentially make even more money. Um, so if we, how to start a, let's try forum here. How to start a forum. All right, so it doesn't look like, it doesn't look like people are looking up how to start a forum blog. But um, as you can see, there are a few different ways. It's gonna be important that you are consistent with this because how to build a website is extremely competitive because there's a lot of money to be made in this one. As I mentioned, um, you can also do Pinterest. And with Pinterest, I showed you how to find keywords that other blogs are ranking for. Um, you can do Udemy, you could also do Facebook as well. If this video helped you out, be sure to like, subscribe, and ring the bell to be notified when I upload my next video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you tomorrow.